guys it's Tina welcome back to my channel so today I have a review video for you guys so today what I'm gonna be reviewing is pink velvet cupcake Bath and Body Works has re-released pink velvet cupcake again and so it is obviously in this stunning fasted collection as you can see I actually really really like it a lot of people were commenting about how it's like red um, but honestly, in my, like, eyes, it looks way more pink to me than red. So yeah, you guys can sort of judge that for yourselves while looking at it. But to me, it looks more of, like, a dark pink rather than, like, a red. Um, I can see, like, on camera, like, I have a mirror behind the camera. It looks a little reddish, but in my eyes, it looks, like, really, really pink. Just, like, a really dark pink, in my opinion. So... Um, I don't really mind the color. I actually genuinely like it. And then the lotion is obviously like this light pink. And then the shower gel, to me, this looks like pink. I don't know where people get red from, but to me, it looks very pink. But yeah, the Fasted collection is just so, so beautiful. I absolutely love the packaging style for Pink Velvet Cupcake this year. And you guys, let's talk about the scent. Oh my god. It smells amazing. So the fragrance notes, as you can see right here on the back, are sparkling red berries, whipped pink marshmallow, and sugared praline. Um, and somebody actually commented on one of my previous videos what praline is, and it's like a nut, which I, I literally have like no idea of like what praline was, but it's like a nut. But what's funny is I don't get a lot of like nuttiness in it. But maybe, like, they just used it to give it more of, like, that cupcake-y vibe. But I mostly get the sparkling red berries and something that's very bakery, which I'm assuming is a mix of the marshmallow and the praline. But if you're told, but if you told me to point those out, like, directly, I don't really get that. I mostly just get, like, a bakeriness in the background. Um, what's mostly, what mostly that I get is the red berries. Like, if I were to tell you what kind of berry that I smell, like, it says, like, red berries. But I get almost, like, whoa, <laughs> a raspberry kind of scent. And, but I get a lot of, like, that cupcake. But I mostly get fruit when I first smell it. But when it dries down, I get a little more of that cupcake. Now, I did actually use this in the shower and then I put on the lotion and then I put on the fine fragrance mist and I will say it did last me a good like three hours I wore it literally like this past weekend when I was going to my boyfriend's house and what I got ready with was pink velvet cupcake and guys oh my god it smelled so so good and I was even out in like the sun I was practicing driving because I'm trying to get my license but even in the heat I was still able to like smell it after like on my skin even after that so um so pink velvet cupcake actually did impress me with the longevity of it but yeah the packaging is amazing the scent is amazing and the longevity is pretty good in my opinion Ugh, pink velvet cupcake really did impress me I've actually never tried it before until I got um pink velvet cupcake recently um, when it first released on the website and I'm actually like super happy that I picked it up because it is just so so good and I do think like I know that they released it for like fall but I do genuinely think that you could wear this all year round because of like that fruitiness that's in it um, I really think that fruitiness really gives it a lot of life and it could be definitely be worn in like the spring and summer um, not just like the fall and winter where you think, you know, cozy cupcake bakery kind of scents are a little bit more popular. But I do genuinely think that you could wear this all year round. And I don't know, it, it sort of would fit the vibe. <laughs> Obviously, you can wear it whenever you want. But I do think that you could wear it literally any time of the year because it's just so like versatile. I definitely would not just limit this to like fall. Um, so I just want to make that point about it. But the scent is just so good. Like, I really get a lot of fruitiness, that red berries. It's almost like a bit of, like, a raspberry. And then I get a lot of, like, that cupcake scent, which I'm assuming is from the whipped a pink marshmallow and the sugared praline. It really gives it that, like, cupcakiness. 
um, and it generally does smell like a really fruity cupcake. So if you are looking to buy pink velvet cupcake, I definitely would recommend it because it smells just so good. And it genuinely shocked me. Like I, obviously I blind buy it. As I was saying, I ordered it online. I had no clue what it smelled like or anything. And it genuinely surprised me um, to the point where it was literally the first thing that I wore from that package that I got. I literally wore that to my boyfriend's house immediately. Um, but so yeah, I definitely would confirm that pink velvet cupcake is amazing. Like it is just such a nice set. And I do keep this mist up with like my favorites over there so that's really saying something and I have so many um so yeah this definitely stands out in my collection it smells so so wonderful literally like a fruity cupcake but yeah this is definitely a very nice scent to have so that is it for today's video guys let me know in the comments if you guys want me to review any other product that I have from like Bath and Body Works even Victoria's Secret um I do have quite the number of body mists and body care and all that kind of stuff, even candles. Um, so let me know in the comments below if you want any other review and I'll see if I can do it. But otherwise, that is it and I hope to see all of you in my next video. Bye guys.